Hello YouTube, um, today I'm gonna make a quick, not, no, not quick, but I'm gonna make a video on Gary's mod, and it's basically just gonna be the basics of Gary's mod. I know, um, right now what you guys see is my whole screen, but when I get in the game, it should be around covering the full screen. So anyways, like I said, this is just gonna cover the basics of Gary's mod, because I had some friends that had no clue had no clue that made no sense I, I was gonna say have had not a clue but anyways yes so so um, yeah here we are when you when you join in it's gonna have all this stuff and you don't have to do this but I have to because of my videos my sounds really loud and then a couple of my videos it was extremely loud and it was drowning out my voice but um so, if you go to add-ons, here you can add add-ons, disable add-ons, delete add-ons, and enable add-ons. So, click add-ons. And here you go to, um, you just go around and you click, see you want to get a weapon add-on, then you click the weapon add-ons. And so, you just look around for a while until you find something you want. Um, okay, well, I didn't really find anything that I liked, so, let's look around, let's try this, and hope it doesn't, some add-ons do not work, so if you get them, um, some just don't work, like, some will create errors and stuff, but if it doesn't work, just get rid of it, which you do by going to subscribed and going in there, so anyway, um, go, this is the button you click to go back to menu. Find multiplayer game. That's pretty self-explanatory. So let's jump in the game right now. Start new game. I'm sorry about my lag, guys. Um, it, Gary's mod is not a laggy game at all. Gary's mod is not a laggy game at all. But um, while I record. Oh my gosh, it's like a lag attack. Yeah. But, um, and yeah, to all my friends on Steam right now that are wanting to make videos with me, and if you're watching this, because I know some of you guys do, that will probably be either this weekend or, the, or next weekend, because this weekend might be a little crazy for me. I don't know why, I just have a feeling... So, um, yours is probably loaded right now, but saying that I have a slow computer and a screen recording running right now that isn't really meant to record games like this, um, mine will take a while. So, I suggest you just skip forward some and whatnot. So, yeah, let's just wait, I guess, forever. Oh, uh, while I'm just, I, I'm gonna talk, okay? Because if I don't talk, it's gonna be boring, like lots of my videos. Some of the things I'm gonna cover in this is how to spray your logo on um, multiplayer, and I think you can still do in single player, and then how to um, change your logo, which logo basically is some fancy word for spraying a picture on a wall, kind of, I guess. At least on gear. Anyway, it's the picture you spray on the wall. Anyway, so, um, and then how to position NPC's eyes. And how to use the fizz gun. The physics gun. What uses the gravity gun has. Because I remember joining Gary's mod. But like, this gun is stupid. It does nothing. It shoots little laser beams and they do nothing. Well, there is where you are wrong, because that gun is very amazing. <coughs> Sorry about that. Like, with that gun, you can use a watermelon and shoot someone in the face with it, and they will just die instantly. Of course. I'll be covering how to fly, because some of my friends didn't know that. I'll be covering a couple... Uh, you think? I'll be covering... Two not really that secretive spots on this map. <clears throat> uh, 
Yeah, so let's just let's just wait. Oh yeah, some more things I'll be covering is how to lay down. Oh, here we go. Okay, so um, sorry about lag. Let me turn that. See if I can adjust that at all. Again, probably not. But I'm gonna try anyways. Medium, low, low. Screw it, low. Okay, cool. So let's. Uh, I expected the lag to be worse. So you push Q to open up this menu right here, and the first time is going to lag. I'm just gonna let you know now. And so spawn list weapons, da 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 da. Weapons, here you go. Now something that made me mad is the Annabella, because I think it looks amazing. You click it, you get a shotgun, which kind of sucks. But you know what, it's okay. So, um, yeah, you get guns through here. You have to have Team Fortress to, oh no, this is the, um, add-on I got. And some add-ons are weird, and they will do that. And, yeah, so if your add-on does that, just get rid of it. Really, there's no use of having it. And then, um, let's see, let's look around here. Ammo, why not? Weird bouncy balls that don't look real at all. You can just throw around. I don't get the point of them. But, um, NPCs. So, I don't know why this man is counted as an animal. Maybe because he doesn't really, um, because, um, what was I going to say? Uh, let me think. Sorry, just uh, talking to people. Um. Sorry, um, there's a uh, my the the top corner of my video is blocked down and whatnot it's because. I'm talking to someone. Anyway, so, um, yeah, crows, this weird guy, and say you are spawning people in, he never moves, by the way, so here, spawning people in, like, enemies, and, um, and say you lay this guy down, like, okay, but you, you don't want him to harm you, wait, first I should show you this, weapons, you push Q, go to NPCs, hover over it, no, actually, you click it. Go here, and then you click sign from here. So, I'm going to use Annabella, because you die. And you lay him down, and you want to sign up a whole bunch of people, but, oh, gosh, he's, he's freaking shooting you in the face. And say somehow you don't know how to shoot your gun, which you probably should by now. Oh, yeah, look at my character. But, um, so what you want to do is you want to push Q, NPCs, and, um, go to disable thinking. You can go over here. You know, they're like, oh, I'm stupid, because they won't move at all. You can do whatever you want. Oh, yeah, I do want to say something about switching the guns. You're going to have to push the number, and I'll um, pick the gun you want and click it. Sorry, one second. Sorry, one second. One second. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, I got problems. Okay, so, um, yes. So, say you are bored and you don't know what to do. Oh, yeah, you can also do the whole ignore player thing so they won't follow you or anything. Um, so you lay down your enemies and then you lay down your guys. Okay, yeah, and so, right now they won't shoot me, so if I do this, they're gonna sit there and they're gonna shoot you, and make sure, oh, no, no, oh, no, no, good guys died. Is there, oh, we got bad enemies, so he's gonna make them disappear with the button Z. So let's get back to, um, 
I told you I was going to show you how to use the, um, gra the, um, gravity gun that looks useless. Say there's an ob an object like such. Like this. You, you just click it to spawn it in. And you click and you're like, well, that's friggin' retard. Uh, actually, you know, that might be useful. And, but still, it's, it's stupid. And it seems like it has no point. So. Yay. No. I'm gonna use a watermelon. So I use watermelon as in no, I'm gonna use a baby doll actually, a really creepy baby doll. And I'm gonna use this person. You um, you pick it up by using right click. You aim at something and you push with the other button. And usually they would have died. And let me try using a watermelon. Cause that's why I always use watermelon, watermelon. Ooh la la, watermelon. He is invincible, but they would die. Okay, okay, anyway, so he's dead. And, um, okay, phys your, um, physics gun. Um, say you want to build something. Like, maybe you want to make this sewing machine upside down. So you click it with left click. You, you move your mouse to move it around. You hold E to rotate, and we'll put it like this, and there you go. Or if you mess up and you push it down too hard, it's going to flip out and fly around. Inside, so, uh, there's all these items with add-ons, you can get more, and so, um, vehicles, and you can spawn one of them, and you access them with E. That's how you um, also get into seats like such and other things. Oh yeah, and you fly with V, which um, is called no clip mode. In multiplayer, it's X to use your mic, and in any game, it's okay. Only multiplayer is G to do your spray logo. And so let me go and um. What else was I going to show you? Oh yeah, if you push six twice and you click on the tool gun, these are all the different things you can do with your tool gun. So right now I have thrusters on, so I'm going to lay down some thrusters on my vehicle. So you're going to drive and like, oh, it's going to be so fast. And while in a vehicle, push control to switch out of into third person mode. So you're like, oh, whoa, I'm going so fast, I guess. It might look like it, but I'm just lagging really bad. Probably doesn't even look like I'm going fast. So I just turn it down altogether. So anyway, no, that's not how you go. F no. Oh, yeah, vehicles, if they hit the water, you the engine will go dead and you can't drive it. So um, push whatever button you have as a hotkey for your thruster. So if you go here. That's what I have. So, push K. And, oh, yeah. But, if you're not pushing the acceleration button, depending on how many thrusters you have, or what, sometimes it won't move. Or it won't move very much. But, I guess I have, I think I have these on the highest power. So, yeah. That's that for you. Let's, let's get out of that car. And so, um, what else was I going to say? I'm going to show you guys something else. G-Man, na 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 G-Man. Sometimes I think G-Man is invincible, but he isn't, because he just died. Um, oh yeah, a very cool feature I like is using tool gun, is put using camera. So if you right click, it's going to look like that. You know, actually, a while ago, I said right click when I was supposed to see left click, I think. So it's going to be stable. But if you push right, left click, it's going to look like this. No, right click. No, I was saying it right. Anyway, when you're like, well, that's pretty useless. Once again, there's going to be a hotkey. So, um, change to a vehicle, or you just run around while you do this. But. So, and then you push your hotkey. You put your key in the camera, but depending on how you laid your camera down, is if it'll follow you or not. So let's get out of here. 
go off my camera. This is kind of hard to do. Oh, wrong direction. Dee -dee. Ah! Oh gosh, bad wall. Okay. So anyway. Okay, so now what we want to do is, let's see, great crowbar out, because crowbars are awesome. Get out your, um, fizz gun, and what is it going to show you? I don't know, neither do you, because I never said it. Um, uh, let's see, you want, you're going to, you're going to do something like this, you are. Um, oh, yes, I'm going to show you how to weld. So, get something, anything at all. I'm going to get a chair. Wait, no, I'm not, because chairs are stupid. Um, let me back up a little bit here. Okay, so I'm going to get a chair, no, I'm going to get a couch, and another couch. I'm going to grab this, and I'm going to extend it out using my mouse wheel, I'm going to drop it right here. Oh my gosh, that was amazing, okay. Well, even when you do do that, it's going to be like, you know, I don't want to um, chink it out of out the um, camera mode, so you're going to have to push your hotkey. Let me hurry up and get over here. Alright, cool. So, um, yeah, that happens a lot. So, get your, one of your items. Move it near your other one. Preferably closer. Oh, okay, here we go. Now, get, pull out your tool gun. And go to weld. So, aim at one. Pow. Aim at your other one. Pow. Now get your fist gun out. Yeah. Like, oh snap! Isn't that just magical? Isn't that cool? And don't you like my guy? Doesn't he just? I turned down character details, so he looks pretty crappy. But let me change the guy. I usually am. Um. This guy right here. This is who I usually am. But yeah. So um, that's how you do that. And um. Let's see, so that's how to weld. I went ahead and got rid of my camera. Now I'm going to show you how to adjust NPCs' eyes and other things you can do with NPCs. So, I'm going to get this guy here and we're going to use um, the eye poser. And you're going to click his face and this tells us where he's going to point his eyeballs. So, I'm going to have him down here and then point him down there and he's going to look down there and he's like, oh gosh. Oh, look at that, that grass, that grass is looking at me. It's so scary. Okay, but, and then you want to be like, well, I want to change his face. I suggest you don't ever use this, because it is so hard to, like, control when you just do this. You do this. And it's going to look so weird. No? To be honest, I don't use this myself, um, very much. See, so he changed his face. Changed his face again. Then if you want to get all fancy, you can be like, hmm, I'm going to do this. You can change things like down here and you make them look however you want, I guess. So I could um, change this so it looks weirder. And you probably can't notice that much. So let me do this. Drop his mouth. I, I didn't even notice that. Um, Drop his mouth. What? No smile? What? <laughs> Give me a second. Let me let me change something. Randomize. Let me push the randomize button so it just randomly changes. Anyway, but yeah, this is how you change the stuff. So and then go to finger poser and um click his chest. No. Click his finger. Well his hand. And then What am I doing wrong? Okay. Right click. And move his fingers. So I'm gonna pull this over here. His fingers going to look all weird. So I'm going to bring this out here. Curl that. Also going to bring this out here. Bring this out there. This out there. It's out there. And <laughs> Wait, actually no, that looks really jacked up. See the finger moving? Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to pull it out here. There we go. There we go. I'm going to yeah, I'm just going to have fun. 
So now that you have completely disoriented his hand, and he's obviously a little freaked out about it, uh, that's not good enough, so get, use an inflator, and click his face and make it bigger, bigger, and be all scared by him. And then, um, you think his, um, legs are too big, so you're gonna slim them down. But, um, his chest is too small, so you're gonna make him fatter or something like that. No, no, you're not gonna get it. We are going to enlarge his arms. And then, um, so that is that. That's pretty much just about everything with there. So that's how you mess with your NPCs. And then, disable thinking. Go here. Heal. Uh, citizens usually will follow you around. But, you see, if you kill them, they will just become normal again, sadly. But, the good news is, after they die... They're laying on the ground. You can still mess with them, man. <laughs> yeah. So that's that. Um, another thing I'm gonna show you is. No, I really don't know yet. Um, I'm just kind of going along with things that people have asked me how to do. Um, let's see. I pretty much cover the majority of things I was thinking about. But I know I'm missing something. Hmm. Mm, I'm gonna kill this head crab while I'm thinking about it. Bam. That was hard. Anyway, so. Oh! No, I already covered that one too, didn't I? In my other video. So, yeah! Oh, I said I was gonna show you two secret spots in this map. If you find here, which you spawn over here, walk over here, look here, you'll find, I think that's the source symbol. You have to be in no clip mode first. Go through here. You'll see here. You go in here. You can just kind of look at this. It tells a, I guess, or whatever. But, um, it's just random things in here. Um, there's a baby doll, which she's in another place in a different map. Another map. And then another thing that's cool is if you go here. Well, that looks weird. But you'll understand this better in a little bit. So if you fly up here. Actually, first, I'm going to show you guys something that I noticed in multiplayer. So I'm going to lay a camera right here so it's always pointed at me. So after, when I fly up here, it's going to start losing sight of me. But that's not the point. So keep on flying up until the surroundings around there go black. And then I have to go a little higher. This is going to happen. you be like, whoa, it's so you're going to be like, oh my gosh, that's so cool. It's a skill model of where you were just. So, this might work, it might not. No. Well, anyway, multiplayer, if you're down there on the, on the ground, and you look up in the sky, you'll be able to see them, and they'll be like giants. So, if I lay the sky right here, I'm like, oh, you're a turd. You're a turd. You want to shoot him? Okay, fine. So, that's not going to do anything. Really? So, yes, there's everything up here. You can still walk around. So, well, that's a pretty pointless trip, right? Wrong. Because if you go down here, you go down, you'll see it. Not that far down. Right, what am I doing? Right here? Up. Down. See, that's the room that's up there. You can't get your physics gun out, sadly, and mess with them, but it's still pretty cool. You can't go any deeper, but it is pretty neat, I think. So that's that. Um, those are two secret places, if you want to call them, in this map. And so I hope this, I hope this helped you out with the basics of Gary's Mod. If you need help with more, comment down below in the comment box or go to my website and contact me through that. So, um, I hope this helped you out. Give a like if you like it. You should still like it even if you didn't. No, I'm joking. Um, but yeah, bye guys.
Oh, wait, I didn't stop it? Oh, my goodness. I'm sorry, guys.